Welcome to Daily News Update. I'm Petty Officer Dustin Diaz, and these are your headlines from around the fleet. Secretary of Defense Robert Gates visited Recruit Training Command Great Lakes July 17th. Secretary of the Navy Ray Mabus also came to RTC July 16th. Mabus and Gates toured the training facility, including Battle Stations 21, and talked to the recruits. This was the first visit to Recruit Training Command for both senior leaders. The 2009 Sailor of the Year Award Ceremony was held in Washington, D.C. July 16th. The award recognizes sailors who take advantage of opportunities in the Navy. I would tell every sailor, junior or one of my peers, to take advantage of every opportunity. That everything that the Navy offers you, grab it, grab hold of it. Take those tough jobs, reward your people, take care of your people, mentor and guide them, because that's what it's all about. It's all about your people. Other honorees include Chief Petty Officers Christopher Green, William Frost, and James Nicholson. The ceremony is scheduled to air on direct-to-sailor television July 20th. Check Navy.mil for showtimes. The 30th anniversary of the arrival of USS Blue Ridge to Japan was commemorated July 17th. The ship arrived in Yokosuka in 1979 as the flagship for Commander U.S. 7th Fleet. Blue Ridge is the longest continually forward-deployed ship in Navy history. The Navy's Learning and Development Roadmap is a personal tool that can help sailors plan their entire enlisted career. More than 30 roadmaps for enlisted Navy ratings are available, including a new engineering aid for Seabees. Log on to nko.navy.mil for more information. For the Defense Media Activity Anacostia, I'm Petty Officer Dustin Diaz. Music